Hi guys, welcome to the Daily Nilu. Today is the third Wednesday of the month. So we have our monthly meditation party today and uh, it's actually, we're doing a Friendsgiving because Thanksgiving is next week. So I'm gonna do a quick video and then run back downstairs and host with Ellie. And uh, I've been putting this topic off for a couple of days. I wanted to do it as soon as I as the idea came to me, but I put it off because I wasn't sure if my mom was gonna get upset when she sees it because she watches all my videos because she's super supportive. So mom, I hope you understand this is for the greater good. So I have a th I have an eight-year-old nephew, which you guys have met. He's He's been on the show a couple of times, Darius, and he's going on this amazing trip with his paternal grandparents. So, uh, and one of his cousins, and it's this it's this tradition that the Cruz family has where they take two cousins on a really amazing trip and allow them to connect. And so he's going and he's been talking about it for like a, the whole year. And so I was with him and my sister last week and I said, hey, Darius, are you ready for your Disney cruise? And he said, yeah, I'm ready, you know, I can't wait. And my sister asked him if he's gonna do snorkeling and all the fun activities. And he says, well, Grandma told me that a three-year-old got attacked by a shark last year. And that grandma is his maternal grandma, my mother. And I know my mom was not meaning any harm, but she's just trying to help. And she's just trying to, you know, give him a, like, just a gentle warning. But what that ended up doing is put a lot of fear in his mind. And now he had this, you know, thought that he's going to get attacked by a shark or a crocodile. And, you know, he was hesitant to go in the water. And thankfully, my sister and I were able to intervene and talk him through it and, you know, mention that it's a very, 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 very minimal possibility of being attacked by an animal like that. There's tons of people that go into the ocean all the time and nothing happens to them. And I wanted to just you know, as a like fair warning to adults, uh, parents, grandparents, older cousins, uncles, aunts, um, whatever, like older people who are around children of young age who are very impressionable. As the holidays come, we're gonna be around each other. Be careful about what kind of messaging you tell these kids. I read somewhere that up to the age of seven, children are essentially walking around in a state of trance, like a state of hypnosis. So everything we say just gets imprinted into their minds. And a message like that, like don't get eaten by a shark or don't get attacked or a three-year-old got attacked can really make a big impression on a child, especially when it comes from your grandmother who you really love and you hold a value and you, you know, really value what she says. So please, please, you know, be careful with what you say around young children. There's no need to pass on our fears to the young. You know, I think we can give advice and be protective of the children without uh, instilling a state of fear, coming from a place of love versus a state of fear. That's it for tonight. Let me know your thoughts on this video. And mom, I hope you understand this was for the greater good. I'm hoping other people will hear this and just be a little bit more mindful about the language they use around children. Have an amazing night and I'll talk to you tomorrow.